Ha! So I made a mistake. <laughs> well, that's lovely. Here we go. Good evening and welcome to this already failing live stream. I didn't realize that the microphone was still on while the music was not playing at all. <laughs> So if you're playing bingo tonight, then yes, you can cross off the first technical difficulty. Good evening everybody, my name is Bart, and I am a big fan of old computer games. As a kid I had a PC, and I played loads of games like Jazz Hair Grabbit, Hocus Pocus, Wolfenstein 3D, a little bit of Doom, Wacky Wheels, oh man, you know the titles. And one of them was Apogee's Cosmos Cosmic Adventure. I'm such a fan of that game, um, I had even had Moxie make me one of those pixel art characters and as you can see it's hand painted, it's handmade and it's Cosmo and it's really cool, it's always hanging behind me during a live stream and I love it, I'm gonna put it back right now. And that's always a bit tricky. It's it sticks with Velcro, so that's nice. All right, yes, this is the alien kit that goes on a murder spree on an alien planet, and it's really cool. Um, thing about this game is that, like uh, other games from Apogee, Crystal Caves, Secret Agent, and Monster Bash, those three Apogee titles got an HD remake over the past three years. And when Apogee was back in business in 2021, or 2020, I think it was 2020 when Crystal Caves HD came out and they had that huge company reboot. And they even announced that Cosmo w was gonna be remastered in some form, but nobody really knows what's it gonna be called. Is it gonna be called Cosmo's Cosmic Adventure HD, like the other three games? Or is it gonna be called just Cosmo HD? Is it gonna come out on Steam, GOG, or is it coming to consoles? Nobody knows the answers to this, because they only teased it in that that John St. John trailer that they put on the internet back in April 2021, if I'm not mistaken, and um, it kind of died down after that. Straight after that, it kind of died down. They did a tweet on the level editor, because it's gonna contain a level editor, which is pretty, pretty cool. But I got some news. I had a talk with Apogee earlier today, and I asked if there was a possibility, a slight possibility, that I would be able to show maybe a small portion of Cosmos Cosmic Adventure HD or whatever it's gonna be called. And they said yes! I mean, that means tonight we are premiering gameplay from Cosmos Cosmic Adventure HD. But there is a restriction I can only show you guys the first level because the game is far from finished, which is totally fine because it's a work in progress. But yes, we're premiere. Again, we're gonna play Cosmo HD tonight. So be sure to hit that like button and stick around because of course we are not gonna play it straight, uh, uh, straight on right now, no. We're first gonna play uh, and follow the original plan, uh, play the original game, because the original game is pretty sweet. We're gonna start off with playing episode one, and I had the feeling, I have a feeling that after episode one, if, if we're able to get through it, we should be, uh, well, we're gonna check out um, the first level, but only the first level of the HD version, and I'm so looking forward to it because I checked it for a little while. I, it's, I just got it today for, and I played it for a few minutes and mine is blown. And uh, to say that I had an early build, somebody from Apogee sent me an early build like years ago and it was really unclear what was going to be the purpose of it, what were they doing with it, nobody had any answers and I wasn't able to show or tell anything about it up until now. I can finally show more. So yes, and this idea originated from the fact that you guys were poking the bear earlier today on Discord. You guys were like, 
is this gonna be a foreboding moment that DOS Gamer is gonna show an HD converted game again as a premiere? And I was like, no, that's not gonna happen. Sorry guys, I'm gonna stick to the original script, the original game tonight. <laughs> and then I started asking around and it's gonna happen. And it's because of you guys. You guys were asking for it somehow. So, yes, this is gonna be a lot of fun. It's gonna be a world premiere, and I'm really looking forward to it. But first, first things first, let's play the original Cosmos Cosmic Adventure. Dude, this is gonna be so much fun tonight. So, I had this thing prepared where we could count down from the, um, from 10 to zero, where is it? Let's see if it's here. What's it? Oh, nay, nay, nay. I was almost leaving. Wait. I put this in. But it's not working because the shout out app is. The shout out app on the tablet is not working. Maybe I have to reset the device. Ooh, that was easy. Maybe that set some soda on the dike. Hashtag give me Cosmo. <laughs> Alright. I have to reboot this machine, but in the meantime, we're just gonna start playing some shoutouts. And I have to do it from the top of my head because I can ook niet afkijken. Damn it! So, time for a round shoutouts. Already played Hansel's. Good evening, Intrinia. I just hit Ctrl Delete. Idiot. <laughs> it's a good thing that doesn't automatically reboot your machine. <laughs> Wrong shout out. <laughs> so the shout out thing is rebooting. In the meantime, I'm gonna crack open a beer. I'd say. I do know some of the shout outs from the top of my head. Cheers, everybody. Mm. Here's a Quidditch shout out. Or the one from a I have to think. Nope, that's not it, but that's Alex shout out. Nope, that's root me. I'm looking for Arthritis' shout out. Come up. No. 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 Where is it? Where is it? Oh, I'm almost there. I'm almost there. This is it. No! That's Will Houston shout out. Then I don't know. I do know where Slipgate shout out is. No. God damn it. I need my list for this Zenpack, but he's not here. Ik ga gewoon het rijtje af. We komen er wel. I'm looking for Arthritis. Nope! Oh, I can play that. That one's easy. There it is! Thanks, Aquinics! <laughs> and good evening, Artritis. <laughs> yeah, that was in the remix. It was double double the perfect dog. Perfection dog, it's called. Oh, no, now comes Skelket online. I'm going to think Wacht. Wacht. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> the tablet is updating its windows. I didn't even know that that was still a thing on that device. I know Ricardo shout out. Boom. In the meantime, I think we should start playing Cosmos Cosmic Adventure. Where is it? Hey, Ruba. We got some great news because you guys were poking the beer. I just asked Apogee and they, they said that I could show the first level of Cosmo HD tonight during this live stream. But of course we're playing the original first. Restarting. So thanks for just being an enthusiast for the new stuff. Let's see, where is my game?
<laughs> yeah, I'm not even kidding. This is gonna happen, so stick around. Uh, the, the thing is not working, so I'll turn it off right now. Here we go. Where is the window? Here's the original game. This is Cosmos Cosmic Adventure. If you have never played this before, be sure to check it out sometime because it's really cool. It's a nice, slow-paced platformer with quite some challenge and unlimited lives. But you have to restart the level if you die, so that's bad. Here goes the demo. We're not gonna watch the demo. I'm gonna play it myself. Or are we gonna read the story? Oh, why not? Hey, Apogee! New shout out to Apogee. Tomorrow is Cosmo's birthday, and his parents are taking him to the one place in the Milky Way galaxy that all kids would love to go to Disney World! Suddenly, a blazing comet zooms towards their ship, leaving no time to change course! Bow! And the comet slams into the ship and forces Cosmo's dad to make an emergency landing on an uncharted planet. While Cosmo's dad repairs the ship, Cosmo heads off to explore and have some fun. With his walkie-talkie, I guess. Returning an hour later, Cosmo cannot find his mom or dad. Instead, he finds strange footprints. Oh no! Has his family been taken away by a hungry alien by a hungry alien creature to be eaten? Cosmo must rescue his parents before it's too late. Alright, that's what the game is about. Let's start playing it, I guess. Let's look at that shout out once more. I love it. If you can guess from what game that introduction is, then you're a legend. All right, it's easy. You guys can guess that. You guys can guess that. In the meantime, I'm going to start playing. Hey, Blaze the Cat, how are you? All right, so I've been looking at the HD version of this game. And <laughs> this is a choppy frame rate. All right, they had some choices to make back in the day. Did we want a choppy frame rate? No. But we got ad lib music for that. No, it's not Hocus Pocus. But I love Hocus Pocus. All right. It's gonna take a while tonight to finish the first episode of the original game. Why? If you die, you'll have to start over. Talking about starting over, wait a minute. You have to see this, by the way. Um, I'm gonna guess... Uh, crusty. Wait, something's off. Ah, damn it, Krusty was already there, but I misspelled it. Wait, I have to restart my game for a bit because something's not technically working the way it should be working. Let's fix it and then... Freaking config files, damn it. Technical difficulties! And hey, Alexi, how are you doing, by the way? Stop the music. And start playing again. Hmm. Ah, there it is. All right, start playing. Oh, it's going to be so much fun. Ah, the new kitten. Ha <laughs> ha. 
<laughs> Evil mirror scratch resistant. Boom. No death counter yet. The shout out app is having some issues and the machine's being restarted as we speak. Maybe that helps. I don't think it's a web socket thing. Welcome back to the family Apogee. Oh, I already got your shout out ready. those legacy games alive. Hey, Untrustable! I can't reach! Yes, a ludicrous day, for sure. this game we had Windows 3.1 on the computer as well and I would go to Windows to play music and then go back to DOS and play this with real CD music but different music non-fitting music hey come on I was four years old Don't you just love the vibe of this game? Gadverdamme. If you pick up a health pickup when your health is low, uh, when your health is full, you'll get 12,800 points! Stuff only falls down when you're looking at it, Riva, that's how it works. Hey TV Taylor! Almost died. And this is the cool thing about Cosmo, he was a wall climber before it was cool. Sweaty home po hands from from actions like that. All right, we got a bomb. Blow it up. <sighs> if I die now, it's all for nothing. I 
I know for a fact that getting out of this secret is impossible. Oh shit! Don't die. Come on, Cosmo. You keep telling me what? Was possible. Well, that's the first level. All right, that was cool. Pause the game. Whew. Aha! So it needs a new version of stack. Ah. All right, let's see if the shoutouts work now. Ah, they don't. Nice. Save? There's no saving. Wait, there is saving. Nice. Thanks for the advice. So if you guys want to see the new and improved version of Cosmos Cosmic Adventure HD then stick around after this episode we'll have a world premiere. <laughs> no biggie, you were right at all. I have to save and I need to learn the hot way. Raining stars. But to be honest, the game looks kind of fair and easy, but later on it's getting a pain in the butt. But for real. And if you're checking out this live stream and you like Cosmo and you're looking forward to Cosmo's Cosmic Adventure part number oh. <laughs> two <laughs> HD Ooh. then be sure to hit the like button. Allergic to aliens. <laughs> and if you blow up these guys, they'll drop a new bomb. Not sure what the purpose of that is, but hey, 100 points for free. Thanks, Ultrafin. Get everything, yes. Nice. Hey, Letty. That's a free bomb. Nice. How do you think this game would look if you could play this with smooth frame rate instead of like 12, maybe 10 frames a second? Uh, are we gonna risk it? This makes me want mid-level saves, you know? Yeah. <laughs> 
You call dibs? How does that work? You wanna be <laughs> Sure! <laughs> hey! That was nice. I'm not sure why I always do this anyway. It's such a high risk for only 400 points. A few times 400 points. Alright, watch out for the red tutukopa. That's a word. From the side they look like air horns with teeth, you know? If you get the chance to stomp these guys when they are still parachuting down, then be sure to do that because... Why are they air fuel powered? Then you'll get them in one hit. quiet right now because I don't want to mess it up now. Since the likelihood that I am is pretty high, pretty intense. Oh yeah, that's the thing I totally forgot about. Cosmic hint, in high places, look up to find bonus objects. That's not what I forgot, but blow up these. Look at the points, 12,800 points. It's in bits and bytes. I can't reach. Oh, no. oh fine. Sounds great. points Oh. What do I do? 
Rose. Let's collect some more stuff before... Look at this! 12,000 points! Another bomb! Apple! Tomato! Whatever! These green... Things carry items and pickups. All you need to do is touch or jump on them. But those are worth quite some points. They'll just die after three hits, I guess. Maybe four. Don't touch the exit sign if you're not ready to leave yet. <laughs> Ricardo. Well, don't try to look up. There might be fruit up in the air that w wants to hit you in the face. 50,000 points! It's raining gems! Hallelujah! This is so worth it! Where did he go? Yeah, tonight we can get the 50 likes, God of War. But you guys have to make it happen. Hey, don't stop throwing lame food at me. It's good like that. Level number three. It did look like I could write them. Whew. I have to take a zip of drink. In the meantime, don't forget to hydrate. It's 29.6 degrees in here, which is pretty doable. But being bit by a mosquito yesterday a few times, you should see my back. It's insane. does this work? You had rain, well we had a bit of a cloudy air, but it's still hot inside. With the windows open, you know. I hope not. I really hope not. Listen to the God of War. 22, 22 degrees, Tim. How do you... How did you do that? Let's see. Ah, let's continue. Almost it. Level number three, here we go. Hey Ricardo, that's awesome! Maybe we can shake hands. South. Dude, I was in the south this weekend. Hey, 
and be quick passing those because they regrow. Watch out for the pinos. Oh, it's a good thing we destroyed that. Ooh, that was close. Some creatures require more than one pound to defeat. Dude, not the birds. I totally forgot about those. They l they suck. <laughs> Efteling, bitterballer. Oh. <laughs> nice, killed the bird. One of them. I forgot how you can climb the trees. Mr. I have a sleepy dog. How are you doing? I think I'm gonna give up on climbing the tree. Maybe in the HD version I'll try it. I really hope that Apogee is gonna release some more information on. Well, I'm, I, I'll keep referring as it as HD, but I hope they will come with some more information on the upcoming Cosmos Cosmic Adventure Remastered title. It's probably gonna be named HD, but I've seen it and it looks awesome. It looks fantastic, and I'm gonna show you guys after finishing this episode. Because Apogee, man, they are nice people. Unlike those birds. God freaking damn it. Leave me alone. What? Nee, jongen. Alright, that's how you get those points. There's no climbing the tree. There's only doing that. Alright, nobody guessed, or I didn't read who guessed where that Apogee intro came from. From this moment in the level, you have to watch out because I do think that. Oh, there's still a floor. That's good. Stomp those nasty crates. Get the points. Get the point. Watch out for the shooting pino. Watch out for the other shooting pino. His brother is up in the tree. Oh! Shit!
God damn it. Yes, it was from the latest ludicrous edition of Rise of the Triad. <laughs> you can hear it uh, from the instruments that are being used. Not sure if it's already in there, Ruba. I mean, the version that I'm showing is uh, later tonight is not going to be representative of the final product, of course. This, it's still in beta testing, and to make things clear, I'm not involved on testing this time. At least not at the moment. So, but I've been ensured. Well, I've been told that. The first few levels. Are playable. But I can only show you. The very first. How do we get up in that tree? Leave me. I want to get there. Hey another Pino. Watch out for the birds. That's one. Yeah, I'm not I'm not gonna make that. I do want those crates. I see what you what you're saying, Ricardo. Absolutely. Even the unfinished products of Apogee are a lot of fun. Oi. Let's try once more. And if it doesn't work this time... Hey Robert Jellyman, how are you doing? I didn't even know that was here! Uh, all we need to do is avoid the birds! Really? I'm not even sure if I found this in my playthrough that I recorded years ago. So that's how we get these points! <laughs> Quit <laughs> following me around, pesky birds. Piece of Paquita. I thought there were like masked tiles in here, and you just had to know. But this is this is great. Another apple that I forgot about. And another piece of fruit that I do not identify with. It looks like a rocket that's going down. Neither have I, Marty. At least I don't think I've ever found this. <laughs> they should equip Cosmo with this in every level. God damn it. This is some handy piece of technology. This thing is probably inspired by... 
Back to the Future's Mattel board. Blow it up. Bonus points. Look at the face on that tree. <laughs> I'll just go to the exit. Uh, another moment to rehydrate. Nee, nee, nee. Shout out, hij wil niet werken vanavond en ik weet niet waar het door komt. Ah, wacht eens even. Dude, it was the receiver that was stuck, but it wasn't stuck. Yay! It works again. Time for a run shout outs in the meantime. <laughs> Now that it works. Wow. So, Alexi, this is your favorite level. Tell us why. Is it because we can fall to our death? Oh, I'm so looking forward to show you guys the 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 upcoming Cosmo title. God damn it, it's so cool. Bam. Is it time for HD? No. Oh, but we can do this. Um, we're in level four. There are ten levels, right? Ten. So, we're in level four. Let's see if this is working. Nay. Hey, why is it not working? Ah, oh, damn it. I thought this was going to be the second death counter, but it's not working. Now we'll just stick with the original death counter. Now that the shout out app works. Die werkt wel, maar die andere niet. I can fix it. I can fix it. This should be read from a file. And what does the file say? It says two. Hmm. That's weird. Come on, shout out the more! <laughs> and the confetti to finish it off. Wait, that's weird. Why is it not working? The second death counter. It does receive the information for it, but... Mm. Oh, name it! <laughs> oh, so I got a button for that. Nice. And did you know that now you can... It saves a lot of time doing it like that. <laughs> You're right, Reva, my bad. But I put it in really quick. Let's just continue with the fourth level. Damn. At least the shoutouts are working. In. Therefore, I'm happy. Evil Mira was right. Trees, they have arms. This is so spooky. Up until now, the game has been quite forgiving. I know I tried this, I know. Damn it, I dropped another
Oi, 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 oi. Ultra Finn, please, that's a forbidden subject. We do not talk about that remake of Sargon. That's a forbidden subject because it's horrendous, it's awful. Go check it out, you'll know what I'm talking about. I played it before, no offense, but that guy doesn't know what he started with. It's a mess, it's a real mess. He makes kind- I'm not a game designer, I'm a game player, but I can see that's, that's not going the right direction. Don't check it out. Listen to a critics, and he's a big, big fan. Oi. I messed up. That was my way up in that tree. That is the forbidden one. I'm not upset, I'm just warning you to not check that out. You don't want that. Really. It's messing up the legacy of what's a good game, you know? This is probably the level where we're gonna die. at the moment lower than that and you're out oh you cannot is that a wall or a tree that's a tree oh Godverdamme. I'm stuck and am yeah I'm stuck oh I thought I was stuck thank god for the the weird masking I'm not getting that fruit. I would like those bombs though, but I have enough bombs, so... But there's fruit up there! Aw, oh, dude, don't stop moving! Alexi, is your popcorn ready? We can wall climb. We have suction cups. It's a bit too hot for popcorn. Insert favorite snack here. Fries. Ugh, I love fries. That's probably the reason this is his favorite level. See, it's 8 9, and we're gonna check out the new game as well. Only one level, and we're gonna play it after the first episode. If all goes well, I might be able to finish that. Finished it before, even during live streams. I already regret going here. Ah. 
Hey Marco! How are you doing tonight on this warm summer evening? And if you're checking out this live stream and you are not a part of the family yet, come on over to Discord. If you really, really, really like the live streams, then consider getting a membership. Become real family. Don't go for the bananas. Looks like Monster Bash. Oh shit, I remember this now. And they keep this all the way to the end of the level. Carefully now. It's been a while. Thanks, Aquitics. Cheers, man. Awesome, brilliant, profound, rocket scientist. Ah, that's nice. Ah, uh, what the fuck? That was bullshit. Oh, I messed up. Did you see that? Skip one bonus level. Thanks for the beer, Aquitics. Just in time. Primo's HD version. HD version of Cosmo. We're halfway. If you're into music like this, come on over to discord.dosgamer.com and listen to Dos Gaming Radio 24-7. 100% free, and if it doesn't work, you'll get your money back. I guarantee. No, I don't. <laughs> Hate!
guys have issues. Watch out for those. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um. I broke the sound! How did I do that? Ah, I need to play this with sound. And you know it. Hey! It's fixed! What the? <laughs> I've never heard that! And of course join the Discord, not only for DOS Gaming Radio, but also to join the DOS Gaming family, because it's a nice community in there. Nice people, always helping each other out, we got free games, free Steam keys, we got uh, chats about developing games, we got chats about, oh, I don't know, if you want to share a selfie, you can, you know? And if you want to know more about the bugs that I m manage to trigger in games that nobody else know about, then... By the way, we need to save up on bombs. And the... can't. Yeah, Alexi can tell. And you don't even know half of the bugs that I found. I even... Destroyed the original engine by dancing through walls whenever I please. That was so good. <laughs> Too bad that wasn't in the original game, but I did like. I love reading about it with Lethal Guitar's vlog, where he wrote about how that happened that I could dance through walls, and he fixed it within a day or two. Stalag Titan. Hatsi Rock Face. Ah, fuck you, Rock Face. <laughs> this space is mine now. Hey Logan Eagle, how are you? to read that story that this is one of your dear childhood memories well so it's it's one of mine yep ZZ top with tush spoiler alert in the HD version of this game that's coming out somewhere in the near future that song is not in here But they, they managed to put in a track that's... If you just joined in on this live stream, my name is Bart and tonight I am playing... Cosmos Cosmic Adventure, one of my childhood memories. I love playing this. I played it before during a live stream. And uh, these are one of the go get to Apogee titles that I love returning to every once in a while. Eat hamburgers and such. More health, though. You didn't get any. Nice. Don't get hit now. And tonight... Oh! <laughs> I didn't see that coming. And tonight, um, I have a world premiere because Apogee announced that they... Well, they announced it two years ago. 
that they are gonna do something with Cosmo, they're gonna kinda reboot slash remaster it, make it HD, make it 4K, I don't know. But what I do know is that I have an early beta build on my computer. They send it to me today and I am allowed to show you guys one level. Not even kidding. Last time I streamed this was two years ago. Yes. Almost three. It was August 2021, I guess. That means that it was already known that Apogee was working on a new version of the game. And to be fair, I wanted to stream Cosmo before, but I didn't. Because I was kind of waiting till the hype started. Like, why not playing Cosmo just like a week before the HD version is coming out, you know? But there's still no date. Still no date known to men when that's gonna happen. Grabbing them for the points. No, I, I do think that, um, how to say this nicely, it's not really going through a development hell. At least as far as I know. And I don't know much. But what I do know is that it's just not really on their scope. It's like a bonus thing they just want to give to the community, the real fans, the hardcore guys like you and me, everybody watching this stream. You guys are... we're all waiting for Cosmo to be remastered, but we can wait, right? I mean, it's been 32 years since this one came out. What's two years? No. So it's not really on their scope. They have new titles like Fexlands, uh, Quest, uh, Quest Master. No. They're mainly focusing on the new titles. Which is fine, because new, new titles are fun as well. Eat a bomb. Exactly. Like, Wolfenstein has a way larger fan base. Absolutely. Great comparison. And so does Doom, you know? I mean, not many people even have heard of Cosmo. Even Commander King did it better, you know? But that's a whole other story. Fucker! I'm not dealing with that. Look at this. If you walk against this, it will push you back. Like... Big time. Logan, it doesn't matter if you're crazy or weird, just join our Discord. Join our Discord because we need people like you. We got way more people like you. It's the anti-social hub, you know. And prost, Adriano, prost. Our health. Thanks for the beer. You know what I want to see? I want to see how Duke Nukem looks. And if he is in episode 2 of Cosmo HD as an easter egg. How would Legal react to that of Gearbox? Oh, he's ours! Don't put him in the new Cosmo! But we're remastering it. No, don't do it! They're not British, they are Australian, I think. <laughs> Still, don't do it! That's a dumb shitty move. I thought you could jump on those. They 
you say why not, Rubaba? Maybe, maybe they can put him in as Duke Nukem or Duke Nukem instead of Cam, you know? <laughs> that would be a double Easter egg. Like, yeah, we're doing this now? Fuckers. That will work, right? The community would totally get it. At least I would. Nuke Dukem. I know what I'm doing. Let's go this way first. Never mind. the sound again. Logan? Yes, I had that same thought with like a lot of games, but I do have to say that with some games my mind was incorrect, like I had the same feeling with um, the game from 94, 93, The Lost Vikings. I. I was like, how could I have ever reached this level on that age? Because I do remember these levels, you know? And then I figured out on a later age, like a few years ago, that I played the shareware version and it doesn't just feature the first few levels, no, it features like a few levels randomly scattered throughout the whole game, you know? That's why I'm familiar with some levels, which I shouldn't have found yet, you know? Resculpting the doggy. <laughs> Thanks for hanging out, Letty, and good luck disciplining the dog. <laughs> but yes, there are some games like Disney's Aladdin, you know, that I'm like, how did I ever reach level 8, the one inside the lamp? Which I clearly did. But everything after that is a blur because I do remember that we we had such a hard time getting through the game and we know the first we knew the first levels inside out but those later ones we didn't because we never reached those and you couldn't save so oh that was nice and yes there were level cheats but we weren't aware of those we didn't watch a YouTube video with some eight-year-old kids spoiling the cheats, you know? Because there simply weren't weren't any. Bomb triple kill! <laughs> ah, double kill. Ooh, watch out for the ceiling spike.
Yep, you can bomb the spikes. Halfway through the level now. Nice, carefully now. This thing killed us last time. Or this one, I don't know. Wrong button. It contained a snail. This is going to bring us back up, right? If you just started checking out this live stream, we're playing the original Cosmo Cosmic Adventure Episode 1. Later tonight, we're gonna check the first level of Cosmos Cosmic Adventure HD. Eh, I tried. Take it. Because we had 50,000 extra points, something, something. Oh, that ceiling spike is hidden way too gnarly. at the bottom of the chat. Boom. C. 
six. Whoa! Little break. Um, that is an excellent question, Logan, and I have to admit that I do not know. I'm not even sure if they already implemented the story, but let's find out together. <laughs> I didn't read the story. Yeah, and I don't know how to turn them off. Those, those... Alright. Level... Six. Thank God the ceiling doesn't hurt. I wish you could kill those. And don't forget to hit the real like button, guys. Not sure if the other is being registered. If it does anything. But I don't mind you guys hitting that one in the chat either. I'm not even sure how you do that. Hey, ice level still B2 levels. Hey Mojo Ryzen, stick around. Later tonight we're gonna check out a new game nobody has seen yet. And it's from Apogee. And it's called Cosmo HD, probably. Job. Now blow it up. Alright, this is the far edge of the level. Kind of reminds me of Simon the Sorcerer and a little bit of Wolfenstein 3D. The vibe that is. And this, these are the levels where you really have to put those suction cups to use. I'm so happy that we found that hamburger. Not because I like ham. Well, probably because. Oh my god, there's a missing tile there. In the background sculpture of the ice with the middle finger. Can we get up there? Yeah, we probably can, but let's. Let's explore that lower section first by. Falling to her death. Hey, Sebastian! Yeah. 
Shake it, baby. gonna keep doing this? That's, it hurts. I love it when they insta die. Hansel? Check out Cosmo HD tomorrow in the morning. Thanks for hanging out with us tonight. Here's a shout out to you Hansel. Be one heck of a guy. Such an awesome man. Yeah, Simon the Sorcerer vibes from the music. we need to go then I'll go this way first what the fuck is it weird if I say that I don't remember that thing at all and it doesn't even wait what, what was that and why don't I remember that it was a bear trap but it didn't hurt Cosmo or anything so I'm not complaining happy about that There's like two of them in the entire game, well that's why I probably don't remember it, but it's weird because I did play through Cosmo quite some times, even during the last livestream, and it's not even that well hidden. Made it, just in time. I would like an extra bomb. Yes. Damn it. And Spear of Destiny vibes from the music. The bubbling sound, you know? Simon the Sorcerer is being remastered after Simon the Sorcerer 1 and 2 which are amazing there also have been Simon the Sorcerer 3 and 4 which were both in 3D different style different vibe you know like the Leashy Suit Larry games that went 3D They're remastering Simon the Sorcerer. I, I've, heard, I've seen a Kickstarter, something about that. Don't mess up this time, Bart. As soon as we finish this episode, it's time for HD. Hey Will Houston, you're just in time. If, when we are finishing this episode of Cosmo's Cosmic Adventure, I am going to show you Cosmo in HD. And I can do that because I just asked Apogee if I could and they said yes. And I just received it today. I checked it out for a little bit. And it's pretty gnarly good. <laughs> and I have permission to show it to you guys as well, but I can only show one level. 
But hey, that doesn't mean we can replay that level over and over and over. Apple G is on fire with those legacy remasters, you know? Better than nothing, exactly. And dude, believe me, it's fantastic. If you like Cosmo, if you played this back in the day, then you're going to love this remaster. Skelcat, wat rusten. up on health points and bombs Hey Jerry the Ferry how are you Long time no see, man. Happy to have you here. Just in time for the world premiere. And if you're checking out this live stream and you are like, hey, I see all of those weird ass hand animated shout outs of awesome games, like Will Houston has that Commander Keen shout out. If you're interested in one, hit the join button and try to read about the memberships and see what the perks are. Marty, have a good night. Your little Zelda cartridge fan. If you want your own an animated shout out then all you need to do is let me know what is your favorite game and maybe a specific way you'd like it to be and that's all. I'll make it. I'll make it work. I've never disappointed anyone with a shout out. Like Alex her shout out, she, she's working on this game you know called Ether and these are some sprites from her game. God damn it, come back. What about Tum Tum? He's not here at the moment, at least I don't think so, but this is his shout out. Guess what his favorite game is? Yeah! Or maybe Rook Me shout out. He's a big fan of Biomanus. Seven. All right, hydration break. This is the, the, the crowded level. I bet that if Jerry the Fairy would have a shout out, it would have something to do with dope fish. How about Hector's shout out? Or maybe Adriano's. Hot tea. What about this one? This one's one of my favorites. He's not a member or a current active member, but look at this. But it can be something easy like this as well. It 
doesn't have to be game related, you know? Or maybe Infrenia with his own logo. Infrenia. Hey, Jasper. And I remember that Coolio, she told me that she is a big fan of um, Yoshi's Island. So here I go. <laughs> oh, you can think as long as you want because sometimes it takes a few weeks slash months for me to deliver. But I haven't made any shout outs for, for a while. But how about this one? And I know that Luca della Riva, also known as Riva style, he's a big fan of racing games, so this is what I made him. I don't have Sailor Moon, but I do have this one. All your days are belong to us. I remember that Hector Eschaton, you only had to wait like two, three months for it, but yeah, we've been using it for two years now, so. <laughs> and might you not know it, haven't you read about it? My name is Bot, and I do MS DOS gaming live streams or something that I just want to play, but mainly with the focus for MS DOS and the love for MS DOS games every Monday night. At least, yeah, every Monday night. That we already saved. Let's load the game. Restore number seven. Gerrit, ik zeg nooit nee tegen een biertje. Ik lust er wel een. And we got something to celebrate later on tonight. Out of order. Oh shit, they can fire? I totally forgot about that. That was hurtful. Personal as well. Chat for the moving probe. I do want to go back. I got the feeling that I missed something. <laughs> That's a total dick shit move. Part of my French. I already had the feeling I was missing out on this, this area, but to be fair, if I would still have full health, I would have more points, would have gotten more points for picking up the next health thing. Hey. I didn't know it was already wearing off, damn it. Watch out for these. Command the Keen 5 ask music if you ask me. Perfect 
timing. Too bad. Too bad there was a ceiling above it. <laughs> oh, what are you talking about? That's how I always launch my missiles. <laughs> Fire the cigarettes. <laughs> Likes, two more likes to get to the 50. You guys are amazing. Let's make it happen. We can get way more, especially when we're gonna start playing the HD version of Cosmos Cosmos Adventure. I hated these exhaustion pipes in Duke Nukem 1 and I hate them in here. <laughs> Leave me alone. <laughs> Like this in GS Jacobit 2 2. If I'm not mistaken, are we getting an airboard later? Ah, we need to flip the flip. Switching the flips. Flip, flip, flip. Ah, ha, 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 for the car. Wait, maybe the car could flip us to the left. I saw that there was a platform to the left. Let's see if it can kickstart us. There. Oh, watch out for those! Double hit. When they get visible, it's one more hit and then they're out. You're out of here! Look at you've been on sly here. Hey! I have to jump on them. <laughs> I thought touching them was enough, but I played too, way too many Jessica Rabbit, I guess. Who remembers where the flip 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 came from? Which stream that was? <laughs> it's been a while. It's been three years. Flip flip flip. Yes, there's something there. Did you see that? But then we really have to time our jump perfectly. <laughs> I can see why you think Hocus Pocus. It, it, it originates from... Ah, um, oh, damn it. The live stream of Mist. The original Mist. I don't think I'm gonna make it. Maybe try it without jumping. DJ Cameroon. This is it. Made it. There's your little, little time machine. DJ kebab deck. Ah, is me nooit opgevallen dat dat daar bleek. I never really played Riven. 
but I think I should. I did play a little bit of the remastered version of, uh, or the HD version, whatever you want to call it, of Mist. Godfuck. That's a good streak. But I don't know, it was different. But it was good, but it was different. I didn't even see the, the wall. How could I have missed this? After this comes level 9, and after level 9, boss, well there's not really a boss stage. Hey Timothy for Mist, and then we're checking out the HD version. Oh, it's almost time, we're almost there. If you just joined in on the live stream, uh, I had contact with Apple G earlier today, asked them, told them that I was gonna do this original Cosmos Cosmic Adventure live stream, and afterwards, or at the end of episode 1, it would be nice. If I would have the possibility, if possible, at least, to check out the the Cosmos Cosmic Adventure in HD that they're working on. But only if that's possible, you know, if it's not possible, I get it. I'd still be playing the original right now. But they kind of granted my wish, they told me. I thought that would be fine. And I heard it like five minutes before I started this live stream. I'm not kidding, it was a close call. But then I'd still have my eye closed on the chat with Apple G. I'd be like, oh, if they do grant me permission then. I mean, we had the same thing with the uh, Rise of the Triad demo, you know? Such nice guys giving me access to games before the general crowd has access to those games and I'm loving it. I died, but that's that's fine. No way, guys. If you want a free membership for a month, all you need to do is turn on that you are willing to accept one in the chat options. Like Alex McAngel's got one now. Manuel May, Vilda, Dami. Oh, dude, this is so awesome. Untrustable, you are oh, such an awesome guy. Oh, we get a lot of. <laughs> Oh, you can jump off the path. Watch out, the snotty drip. Congratulations on the new memberships. I'm being so careful right now.
want to go back. Yeah, tricky level, but really doable. I mean, as a kid, this might take you a few attempts, but hey. I'm coming. <laughs> ah, shit. <laughs> this music, very Wacky Wheels esque. Very Wacky Wheels esque. Right? To be fair, this track could. Wacky wheels perfectly. Come here, Groene Kutrups! Yeah, these switches are so easy to be overlooked. Thank you, Untrustable. Will Houston, your kind words really mean a lot. Bestest and nicest, friendliest community on the YouTube. And really, that wasn't even really a thing that we were going for, but... Man, it just happened to be like that. Hey, Moxie, guess what? Epogee told that I could do it. But only one level. Nate, I'm too loud to open the window. And it's only 29.7 degrees Celsius in here. I don't care. I don't mind being shiny and sticky. Our trade is untrustable, Ricardo, Sebastian, Hector, and Dad, and Riva, and Timothy all say hi, Moxie. Hi all. <laughs> yes to all. Yeah. <laughs> all of and DJ Kama, and Smash Dash, and Timothy. Uh, your yeah, oldest is in there. Moxie has like the most annoying shout out here. <laughs> I know. You can have a special one. It's fine. <gasps> Dude, it says Nukem. <laughs> I, I keep being surprised by stuff like that, you know? I knew, but I forgot, and now I know again. Robert Jellyman says hi. Keep the tuxy mug. <laughs> I once 3D printed the taxi, partially. Where is it? Behind me, between the, the rubble. The rubble and the shits. Yes. Yes, there. And Moxie brought beer, so that's nice. That's really, really something. She's nice. This thing says, hey you. Watch out for those fire thingies. And the bird! Fuck the bird! Oh shit. Gadverdamme! Kutvogel! Ah! 
how many hours has the old 3D printer already on the clock? Ooh. Ik zou het niet eens weten, eerlijk niet. I think we might have used it for about three to four hundred hours. I don't know, does it keep track? It might. Like, just like the printer status pe uh, pajinas. No, <laughs> the, 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 what are they called? Pages that you can roll out of your printer to see how many pages you've printed. Godverdamme. What could I have known? I wish I'd still have my airboard from Mattel. Mattel Nyers. <laughs> pajinas, pajinas. It's a real word. It's a long version for page. I don't make the rules. Books are filled with pajinas. Demma. <laughs> I'll get your attention back to the stream by just saying the word pajinas. Curious how the auto translate tool from YouTube is gonna trans pajinas. The clam tone that does it, right? <laughs> Apple G. Wait and snicker. Wait, where's the health pickup? Did I blow up the health pickup? Ga weg. Ga toch fietsen. Demonetized. <laughs> He's the boy from the Netherlands that said vaginas on the live stream. Maar wacht, als u nu belt. I, I don't know, I'm not. No, 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 I'm not biting it. Section completed, press any key. Any, 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 any. Yeah, I need. Ricardo's married, he only knows vagina one. Here we go again, another bonus level. Chat and I messed up, but congratulations on the anniversary of the laptop. <laughs> yeah, I remember when we collected some money so you could have that awesome gaming laptop. That's been two or three years, I think. I don't even know. We're not aiming for a high score tonight. No, let's pause the game. I'm gonna go for a quick toilet break. You guys solve this riddle for me. Listen. I found this piece of music, video gaming music, but I just don't know which game this 
piece of music originates from and that's where you guys come in so try to solve this for me see you in two minutes Amadeus, congratulations, you won! <laughs> yes, that was Death Rally. I know, these music quizzes are way, way, way tougher than the guess with, uh, what pixel art or pixel character this game... Uh, which game this pixel art character originates from, that's way easier. And guess what, I'll be making more of those really soon. Uh, because they are easier to make and I'm already running out of these music quizzes. What did he won? He won a announcement and the announcement is hit the like button and join our discord stop the music and let's start playing level number nine. He would have won a handshake, but he's not really nearby. At least he's not in my real visual, so I'm not able to shake the hand. Oh! That's in hand. <laughs> and thank you for all of the hearts in the chat. Not sure what those mean, but I love it. Timothy! Be nice to the asphalt. Alright. Oh, dude. That was not announced. Honor and glory. It's good enough. After this level, we are gonna check out the Cosmo HD. How do you do that to a barrel? Tonicky, tonicky, spout water. But very nice, Rookmi. Very nice. Oh. Yeah. Nee, moet je het gewoon even naar me appen. Voor mij kan je het niet aanpassen. Gewoon even appen, pas ik het morgen aan. Dat is beter.
Well, I did... I do see a lot of action going on in the chat. So I'm not ignoring it, that's for sure. You can see it in the chat. It's quiet right now, the heart. Is it limited? Can you use any emoji you like? Oh, now you get the shy face. The, the, the... That's nice. And the hearts. I do like the feature. I think I'm gonna keep it. Ultra kill. Oh, yeah, I remember this level. This one's gonna hurt. I believe that my gameplay video on YouTube of this particular level, it features a death. too fast with the bombing. Watch out for the spikes! Why did I destroy the flower? Because it spawns these fuckers! The, 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 those! The parachute ones! Right? I always destroy those! Should I not? Give me one good reason not to kill them! Caring. Oh, yeah, 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 cheap hit city. I'm opening up a new beer. Oh, yeah. You can jump into the flowers. Dude, I forgot about that. I still don't care. That one spawns, spawns one of those blue guys or all of them. It's so lovely that Apogee is gonna let me do this. <laughs> I could have already started up the game, but I'm making you guys wait for it. And I'm really sorry. Oh, I'm not. Just building up the tension by playing the original. We're almost there. It's gonna die. It's evil. You had me think it was a nice guy.
It spawns way more than you advertised. was close. Same guy, he's, you know, he's out of bounds, you can see him. Alright, let's put those bombs to great use this time around. The bomb bombed himself, I saw it. BFG 9000, not three, nine. <laughs> Ah, vieze bloemkool. Broccoli. Broccolele. Get those. I've tried multiple times. You won't make it. Lemmings vibes with those chimes. Too 
watch out for those! Those little... Red hearts, they bite! Fucker. enough bombs I think you can jump over that thing but yeah I know but I I, I wanted to go to the left as well for this you know and not for these do not get those. They are exactly worth nothing because they'll kill you. Oh, there's another level with the main menu music in it. But this one is not as evil as the one that we sit. Uh, seen just now oh let's just get it over with here we go yeah technically two more but that one's really a long level it's more of a cutscene you know Jake and Elwood will poop up P -p 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 -poop up, poop up. Get your shits up gonna be worth it but I had to try it anyway I love it that when you step into the light the whole game turns EGA on you or CGA all right write the word extra it's the second word fourth word is destroy thank you Ricardo just like that the word Uma mau mau Yeah, did you see that God of War that was insane? Ah, uh, too bad. First word is four. Too bad I don't have any bombs to, to blow them to smithereens because those signs are worth quite some points to blow up. But. Heel goed. Maxi just sold a car today in the store and she always likes it when that happens. And so do I. And if you want to take a look at Maxi's handmade cards, go to. 
www.madebymoxie.nl Godver, jij bent echt een vieze, vieze, gore pino. Now you're done for. Here we go. Some more bombs. Points. So we need to blow up these things. Well, we already knew. But I don't have bombs. I wish I had bombs. It's a good thing this level isn't. Such an asshole level as the last one was. bombs now. Wait, the explosion hit me? Globes. Performance issues on the game, I guess. Another double kill. so awesome. 
In a few minutes we're gonna check out the HD remaster, world premiere guys. <laughs> I blew up a flying snail! Sucks to be him. Oh, that would be amazing, God of War. That doesn't happen on a weekly base, but that would be lovely. Alright, let's get to the second part of the level. Not sure how I managed to get past this when I was a kid. Really, I don't. But I know I did. Well, it's a good thing that the HD version runs smoother. I'm not sure what happened. Alright, we got the shield. Hey, Plastic African, let's go.
Oh, we got it. shit! Wow, untrustable. That's insane. Yes, don't forget to turn on that you want to get a free month of membership. So you'll get one from the untrustable. All you need to do is turn it on in the chat. We just finished episode one. But now you can turn it on. A uh, Logan, you already got one. Richard, maybe, maybe won't happen. Yeah, the sound. I know, man. <laughs> One more bonus stage. Trustable, you gave away too many memberships tonight. There's nobody left to claim any. Everybody, everybody, literally everybody in the chat has a membership that is able to. Maybe Retro Dawn still needs one. <laughs> I'm not sure why the game is so stuttery all of a sudden. Let's just finish this bonus level. And then we're gonna do the thing that you guys have been waiting for all night. I am going to show you guys the new and improved Cosmos Cosmic Adventure. And really, it's gonna be amazing. If you're a fan of Cosmo, you're gonna love it. At the start, it it feels a little bit weird with jumping and all, but that's because of the smooth frame rate! <laughs> I think I have some DOSBox configuration issues. Welcome to the family for the entire month, Retrodon and Likos. So nice. See you guys get membership for a month. And if you decide that membership, <laughs> membership, membership, membership are the way to go, then you can always consider extending it to yourself. And if you go for the Blakestone tier membership, I'll even make you a animated shout out like I did for Tum Tum. But then one with your name in it, according to a game that you love from back in the day. And we got a new subscriber as well. And yes, that was a Lego sound effect. Dosebox? Dosebox is like, come on, show the HD version of the game already. This is... Let's get this over with. We're almost there. I'm just gonna open up all of these barrels. Fall into the mouth of shittiness. Welcome to the family if what happened. Oh, wow, this is such such a foresight. I've never seen the game stutter this much, not even on the real 386 machine. You can even hear it crackle! Shake it, baby. There goes the bonnetje. What's happening? Is Cosmo falling to this doom, to the abyss? I know that will make the the transition to HD way more impressive. It's like I'm doing this on purpose, but I'm not. Is there no end to this pit? 
and what danger awaits below? Yeah, 40, it's insane. You're such a good guy, and trust me. Not even to mention sponsoring Moxie's favorite pixel art things. Like the, the Doom Face, the Doom Face. Well, that was, really was the working title. And the, the Gargoyle, or the Demon Head. Yeah. Our Cosmos Cosmic Adventuring days finally over. No, 32 years later he's getting an HD remaster, but Apogee is not letting lose anything about that. Will Cosmos parents be lightly seasoned and devoured before he can them? Find the standing answers in the next two new shocking, amazing, horrifying, wacky, and exciting episodes of... It has moments, I guess. Cosmos Cosmic Adventure. Thank you for playing. Cosmos Cosmic Adventure consists of three adventures. Only the first adventure is available as shareware. The final two amazing adventures must be purchased from Apogee or an authorized dealer. The last two adventures of Cosmo features uh, exciting new graphics, new creatures, new puzzles, new music, and all new challenges. Here we go. And if you want, you can get this original game on Steam as well. Jesus. But I was already on number one because back in the day in 1991, 1992, my bad, when this game released, the Simpsons were really, really, but like really popular. And that's why Bart is already on number one. Then Lisa, March, Itchy, Scratchy, Mr. Burns, Maggie, Krusty and Homer. <laughs> I had no clue why this is going on. All right, everybody, the moment I've been promising. Check the high score in the HD. Yeah, I want, I want to know that, if they did that in the HD version as well. All right, we've been playing the first episode of Cosmos Cosmic Adventure, uh, the original MS-DOS version. I had contact today with Apogee and I asked, is it possible for me to show off a little bit? Oh, well. Just like the tip, no. like the tip, like the, maybe the first episode they were like no, but you can do the first level. And I was like yes, really? <laughs> what? <laughs> Are we doing this? Yes, and we're doing it right freaking now. But I cannot. Wait, I can. Why is it? It's not showing. My bad. Did you hear that? You didn't hear that. Wait. Waar is mijn venster? Niet zo schudden. Maar wil je nog? Ja, heel graag. Oh. Uh, where is the window? Where did the game window go? Oof. Is it this one? No, it's not this one. Yeah, it's this one. You heard the music. No, but you didn't see anything. Uh, that's a bit... What's going on? Here we go. This is the world premiere of Cosmos Cosmic Adventure. HD or not HD, nobody knows. Again, I cannot show you any more than the first level. Share this stream with your friends right now. We're gonna do it. I'm gonna read the story. I hope it's there. Tomorrow is Cosmo's birthday and his parents are taking him to the one place in the Milky Way galaxy that all kids would love to go. Disney World! Disney World is still in the final version. Well, it's not the final, it's the beta. 
Suddenly a blazing comet zooms toward their ship, leaving no time to change course. If the word or the, the mention of Disney World is gone in the final version or the released version of this game, then do not bother Apogee with that. I mean, come on. This is the beta. It still says Disney World. That's nice. Kapow! The comet lands into the ship and forces Cosmos Dad to make an emergency landing on Uncharted Planet. If you look at the color palette of this main menu, you can already see a little bit of Amber Heart Studio, Amber Heart Games. Uh, uh, well, a little bit of touch into it. That's because Primos is close to not helping, re not really helping out with the game, but he's into um, a little bit of the artwork and he's doing a fine job as far as I can tell. While Cosmo da Cosmo's dad repairs the ship, Cosmo heads off to explore and have some fun. Strange footprints. Wow, look at the alien and he's large. Primos is only helping out with the artwork. He's not working on the game itself. That's all I know. Dude, this is so cool. Wait, did it say Disney World? No, it said Disney World. Don't mess with me. <laughs> Alright, really. You should see the smooth frame rate. Credits. It's still the original credit screen with the modern... Well, I do think that this is still a work in progress, so... These are just the old names, you know? Achievements. I'm not gonna show those. I'm not... I know that they're in here, but I'm not gonna show those. And I'm not gonna show the Steam Workshop. And I'm not gonna show custom levels. Because I can. I made a deal. I can only show... The first level, I'm not even sure if I could show the, all of these main menu things, but look at this. Episode 1. Episode 2. Episode 3. Alright, Apogee, I need, I, I'm not 100% sure if I can press my right cursor right now. Is there another episode? I don't know. I really don't know, and I... Not really sure if I can press this button because I might spoil something, but maybe it's not that. Oh, a demo! Don't look at that demo. That de where's the music? Okay, do it. I don't you do it. <laughs> I will do it. Ah, oh, episode one. <laughs> Whoo! But there might be. You never know. It's still a work in progress. High scores. Episode one. User. Hey, these guys are not Homer, Marge, etc. But I saw some familiar names in there. Hmm. So now we know who's already had access to the game. Oh huh, well, I'm the first one to show it off, so that's really cool. Here we go. All right. World premiere, guys. Yes and no. Um, Alexi, I had the same idea, like jumping feels a little bit slow motion and gameplay feels a little bit slow paced. Falling feels faster than jumping up and that's only because this game has way more, way more frames. This was something that wasn't possible in the original. And guess what? If you don't like this, then you can switch back to the original graphics. Or maybe back to the... Nice color palette. <laughs> Ooh, 
man, I love the new colors. Here we go again. Damn. Still with smooth frame rate though. I love the idea of the wipe. It's so good. It's, it, it plays very nice. The, the music, dude, the music. I remember that you guys had like the worst reviews for um, Crystal Caves and Secret Agent because of the music. Well, the original didn't even feature music and there was still an option to turn it off if you don't like it. And people were still being potty mouths about it and... <laughs> You added verses and, and such to the music and it's... I love it! Is there an option to turn on... No, I cannot turn it to ad-lib music or anything else at the moment. And everybody that's checking out this live stream right now, this is a world premiere, but do know that this is not really something that is um, showing the final thing. It's still a work in progress. They're working on this on a daily base, probably a daily base. And believe me, more features are coming. That's what I've heard. This is not the final product, probably far from it. I've heard that not even all the episodes are fully playable yet. Well, maybe like this, but not like this. No, we, we stay with the, the new music. Wow, isn't this cool? Freaking world premiere. Ah, Dean Lion. Let's do the back. Come here. Come here. Alright, first bomb. Not even to mention the background artwork. I believe it's... It's parallax now. And it wasn't before. So that's gonna mess with your head in the bonus levels because you really need that background in the original for the bonus levels to know where these springs are, you know? I hope I die. <laughs> Sounds a bit negative, but... Ah, too bad, I survived it. Well, I have this as a shout out, that's enough. Yes, that's a new shout out. Oh, dudes, I got bad news. If I hit that sign, it's over. I cannot show any more than past this sign. Unless Apogee tells me that I can, but. Adriano, good night. Jaren Moore says the original adlib slash media will be accessible. Not sure why it's not available. Ah, there goes me stars. <laughs> well, I already kind of 
assume it would because you did the same with the rise of the triad. So it's available from the settings. Ah, but I'm not sure if I can. Oh. Ooh. <laughs> oh, you can set it to wide as well. Oh, damn it. I, I put it to original. Oh, my stream layout is... is Def, this is gonna get handy on some certain levels. Yeah, that's nice. Jaren says, go ahead, bot. Play the second level. Dude. Apogee, you guys. Mm. Don't tell Moxie, but I love you. <laughs> oh, you can tell her. I think she already knows. Let's go. Wait. Press. That for a console? No, it's not coming. <laughs> it gets wacky later on in the track, absolutely. Hey, the shield power-up is in here. New enemy. This is the only snail, by the way, in the first episode. I hate those guys. Ow. What are the lyrics of this song? <laughs> It was a world premiere for me as well today. I heard this audio track for the first time today and I was like... I didn't know you guys were gonna do a retake on the music and... It's insane! Ah! And if you're checking out this live stream right now, come on, hit that like button. Do it for Cosmo. If you're a big fan of Cosmo's Cosmic Adventure from 1992. And you will love this when it comes out really well. I assume. But that. Don't tie me to this. I assume that it's coming out this year. Come on, please let it be this year. Make it rain. What's up with the number four bombs? It looks like a nine. Halloween and Christmas levels, you never know. You never know. Though, this one has like a different foundation to it than the, the Crystal Caves HD and the Secret Agent HD have. But that would be great. DLC for Cosmo. Can you imagine that? If you would tell anybody that that, that, that was gonna be DLC back in the 90s for Cosmo's Cosmic Adventure. The first reply would be, what's DLC? But still, that's really cool. Valentine's Day level. More suction to the cups. I mean, yes. <laughs> oh, 
Booba says, now that I'm seeing this, I am even more excited, dude. Now that I'm playing this? Me too. But I've been looking forward to this day for about two years now. So... <laughs> It's really unfair that I get to play this and you don't. <laughs> really? You're missing out. Make it rain. Oh, nothing. Play Haya Ding Dong. And look, the masking is the same. through the second level guys that's bad news I already played one one level extra than I was allowed to play I really want to know what Duke Nukem looks like in this version of the game in episode 2 as an a as a, as an easter egg I really want to know what he looks like with this color palette. No way, Jaren says you can play another. Hey, he's split in two. That's the forest one. It's awesome, it's really... Get those. Those them apples. Yeah, well, I did see that the level editor is already in this version of the game, but I can't show it because it's not working. <gasps> Dudes, bonus level first. I turned up the audio so you guys could hear this. <laughs> this is smooth. <laughs> Look at the stars being parallax and all. Still listening to the same music though. But I don't mind. Oh, oh, I see something that's broken. Look at the star, the red star in the background. That's because it's a looping thing. And it doesn't quite loop perfectly, I guess. But hey, everybody that's watching this, do know this is early beta stuff. This is unfinished. Not representative of the final product. But believe me, if this is already unfinished... It's I can't wait to touch the final product. Oh, I'll screenshot that for you and send it to you after this live stream. I'll make sure that lands at the right person.
<laughs> Already finding bugs. You know me. Oh, dude, these these pickups look way better on this game. Yeah, now I can clearly see what they supposed to be. Me! Ah, who cares? <laughs> Switch to EGA for a second. Uh, it doesn't work in the, the menu screens. Alright, the forest. This music! It... I have... Crash Bandicoot vibes. Alexi, good night. Thank you for being here. And I hope you enjoyed this live stream. Another world premiere. The switching of uh, uh, graphics did work. But you just didn't see it. In the menu. Really, dudes, look at the parallax background. That's really adding some detail to the game that I've always wanted. I didn't know I wanted it until now. I won't get Terry angry. Besides, Terry is also a really nice guy, once you get to know him. At the start he's just really... For an American he's a really large dude and he's really in... <laughs> well... He's just a large dude and he's such a nice guy. He, he looks grumpy but he's not... Ooh, strawberry looks really nice red. Oh, interesting, uh, Iron Kill. I the thing, yes, and I I say me forgot about it, but now I got time for it. So let's let's talk tomorrow about this. It's nice. It's nice. Leak me a gif. <laughs> But I'm already seeing three tiny graphical, well, not errors, but things I'm not 100% sure that are correct. And I'll let you know after this livestream. Yeah, but in the original games, they look like a rocket launcher pickup as well, so... That didn't change. I'm about to die. <laughs> I want to see Angel. The Angel version. Dude, can you see that the pickups, they have that shine that go over them. It doesn't happen on these apples or on these rockets, carrots, whatever they are. But I did see it happen on those grapes. Does it happen on the bananas too? If those are bananas? No. died. Is there a new idol animation? I like questions like that. All 
I'll have to ask Moxie to repaint this to the right color. Well, they already kind of match. It's Whoa, did you see him shook his head? It's like you guys stole the color palette from my Cosmo. Hey, Enric Penguin. Here we go. And that's the thing about Cosmo. If you look at the shading, the darker side, his shades on the left, like the lights coming from the right, and you can see that in the background artwork as well. But if he looks to the other side, you can see, see you can still see that the same side is dark and light. That means, or bright, whatever, that they didn't just mirror these sprites. No, they reshaded them from both sides. And Cosmo. The original MS-DOS Cosmo was one of the first to do that. I'm not 100% sure, I didn't read a wiki on this. But if you compare it to uh, Duke Nukem 2, or Commander Keen, or Hocus Pocus, or Jazz Jackrabbit, those sprites do not have such complexity. It's really, it's really a nice addition. Sideways. <laughs> I love such subtle details in a game like this because I know that. People that created games like this... Oh, dankjewel, Boetje. There's a pen in your hair. It is? Yeah. Here it is. Okay, thank you. Because they were struggling to fit like a game like this on a floppy disk, you know? And having added sprites to it for left and right, I mean, back in the day, I didn't notice it at all, you know? Yeah, Maxime had a pen in her hair. And she didn't know. Let's see if we can find the secret. No, oh, she didn't know. She Honestly, she was looking for it. I saw it. She was checking her pockets where the pen went. And it wasn't a fashion statement. <laughs> But no, after this, this is the last level I'm showing. I don't want to spoil you guys. You guys, I want you guys to figure this out on your own whenever it hits the internet. Maybe when the time comes, we can...
can ask Apple G nice and do another giveaway like three Steam keys. I don't know, whenever the game launches. That would be amazing. No promises though. But that would be I don't know. Another privilege to do. There we go. He made it in one attempt! Took us like three, four attempts last time I tried this. No, I'm not gonna tell you what happened. I never knew what to do with these guys. That, good night. And Aquitics as well. As you can see, the parallax up and down is not really a thing, but left and right. Max, if you had to choose between this or this, what do you like more? Or this? Or this? This? Why this? Why are these colors better then? They're softer. Yeah, but who cares that they're softer? Moxie made up her mind. This color palette is way nicer. And fuck the birds. They're everywhere. I wouldn't like being attacked by a bird. Well, let's find out. No, it does not. It's solid background right now. Still cool though, but... I just love that you can switch between them. Well, I just finished my brow too. Hey, what? Hotfur. Let's see if we can make it to the exit of the level without dying. Please. Oh, we found health. That's nice. Where's the exit sign? There's no exit sign. I'm gonna wait for all the birds to come because there are a lot of birds. That's all six of them. I don't want that. I don't want to be part of that. <laughs> Entering level four, but before we do, we're not gonna because we told Apogee we weren't gonna. Um, that was nice. That was really nice. Let's see what else we can explore in this Dude, that music was nice. Yeah, did you hear that? I, 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 I don't, I cannot show you guys that level. I, I promised, but that was really cool. I already shown more than I was allowed to, I guess. Instructions not working. Credits not accurate. 
I don't see the, the team working on it. Though at the start, I saw the logo of the team that was working on it. Create a new level or edit an existing level. I think it's not working yet. If you look at the Steam Workshop Browse latest, it's empty. <laughs> Trustable will bail me out. From Apogee Prison. That would be nice. <laughs> Weird. <laughs> All of these songs are in here. ZZ Top, nice. <laughs> this song is called ZZ Top. Rain, on and off. Oh, that's nice. This is the level editor. Um, this is what it's gonna be like, as you can see. But I have to tell you that it's not fully functional yet. Not in the version that they sent me, so. Therefore, I just crashed my game. It's it's not gonna do anything anymore. Yeah, copy and paste empty stuff. That's what it's gonna do. And that's all there is to it. <laughs> Let's see if I can exit the game. It's not gonna let me. Nope. But yes, guys, that was the world premiere. Where is it? Why is it not showing? Oh, that's nice. I crashed the game on purpose, yes. Alright, this is the last thing I'm showing about this game. It's okay. Idiot. What are you doing? Come on. We got a visitor. Huh? Come on. Come on. Circle chair. Trying to lure something. I'm going to show you guys the achievement. No? <laughs> Heck! I'm going back in. <laughs> I was about to be attacked, but the the animal was like, no, I'm not gonna. No, he's not worth it. He's not worth the blood. He's not worth the blood and suffer. Give it a good one. All right, I'm gonna show this. So there are already achievements in the game, and as you can see, I already made it to two achievements. And um, this is like a list view of it, but um, yeah, sure. Uh, yeah, so many. Maybe it's uh, gonna be represented by icons in a later stage, like they did. No, we don't have a cat. We have a pet bird at the moment, but he's a bit performance shy. <laughs> and he's been out his cage for a while tonight, so. Hmm? Yeah, put him there. But these are the. Um, Achievements and there are gonna be some more maybe I don't know But here's one it's called super strong get maximum health like five When you eat two hamburgers Collect hamburger Ride the hooverboard in the forest look I made it Max Payne fan. The game features a cameo appearance of Duke Nukem due to Apogee Software published and developed this game. But I hope it's in the HD version as well. Of course I can just 
go and check it out on episode two. But I'm not gonna because I promised them not to. And they didn't ensure me that these are final yet. Well, at least not even playable, maybe. So... Hmm. Nice. All right, guys. Name it in the chat. Name a Apple G classic game, and I'll play it for like the next hour. Yes, Sebastian. Let's arrange that really soon. Uh, the server thing, the mini server. Most of it's most of it is playable, but you, you Jaren, you don't want me to play it right now, right? Hmm. Yeah, that's what I've told. Comes good. Can you control with the controller? Ruba, you ask the questions. I got a controller here. All I need to find is a wire because the wireless thing is not here. Um, I got a USB-C cable here. Now I need... <laughs> device to turn the USB-C into micro USB Yay! and I got a drawer full of USB extensions so let me, let me figure this out for a second oh. no but this is normal USB to use what say you? Yeah, I, I, I don't have, I don't have a USB, micro USB cable nearby, and I need that for this. I do have it the other way around. Oh my god, I stuttered on my kruis. Yeah, that was heel fat. It doesn't. I got it the other way around. It doesn't. Doesn't work. Off Steam, go ham and make plenty of notes. I will. I will. I will. I will. I will check it out. Oh, dude, this is perfect. <laughs> USB C to normal USB. Wait, that's. Me. I can do the USB C. And to PS2! <laughs> um, I don't have that at the moment. I have no cable in the boot. I don't have a cable. You went to the action store, I see. Yeah, I got the same. They, they're so cheap. They're so cheap. Infrinia. Thanks. Infrinia. And Sean. This was a blast from the past. So what other titles can we check out right now? Original Cosmos at episode 2, but... I know what you're saying, Ricardo, but I'm not gonna... be able to finish that tonight. I see two people saying... Raptor. Well, we did Raptor really, really like a few weeks ago. Blakestone. Secret Agent, Mystic Towers, Mystic Towers. You know what? I'll check out Mystic Towers. I really never played Mystic Towers. Oh, that's a shame. I know. Boom. Let's see. Mystic Towers. Do we have Mystic Towers? Of course we do. I'll let you know in the morning, by the way, if the game... Wow, this controller is heavy compared to this one. This one has USB-C. I'm in the action. Wait. Wait. Back to Cosmo. 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 Maybe this will work, but I'm not sure because it's not an A brand controller, you know. A brand. Uh, guys. 
It is doing something. And this is like a 15 euro controller from the action. I use it for the Nintendo Switch. So yes. Controller support confirmed right now. Oh, the screen is black. No, 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 no. I can see. Wait. Every time I restart the game, this happens. That's what you get with modern games. Yeah, I know, USB 3 to USB C, and I got those, but I need micro USB ones, and I didn't have that. <laughs> so that was my problem. All right, back to Mystic Towers. Boom, lost 10 viewers. Oh, he's stopping with the... <laughs> with the Cosmo thing. I came for that. <laughs> Mystery... Myst Mystic Towers. Again, shout out to Apogee for making this night. Micro USB to USB female. Oh, I need it. USB C to micro USB. USB C female to micro USB male. Jeron, thank you. Thanks a lot. This really was awesome. And um, I'll talk to you later. I'll send you some feedback from what I've seen. I'll send you screenshots straight after this live stream. Let's see. Is my DOS box in here? And thanks for all of the hearts and likes. Really is lovely. There we go. I never played Mystic Towers, I guess. demo oh yeah this one I never played this I had a game like this on the spectrum ZX I never played it. Yeah, I know it's a I know it's a bit loud. I turned up the audio for for I'm I'm already putting off my headset, but I could just lower the volume. I turn up the audio a little bit for Cosmo of course. pick stuff up ah I like that by the way it was a bit of a tutorial that we just had pull with backspace dude I would have loved this when I was like 14 yeah, keyboard controls are my friend. <laughs> Though, oh shit. <laughs> oh, I love it. I have a mini map. What's happening to him? Um, I played quite some. Um, what the fuck? 
I played quite some Wiz and that has similar controls to this. That's what I'm here for, William Strong. Hey, you, 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 you. <laughs> Eat the apple. Eat the apple, old man. You can use an apple. Not hungry. <laughs> I have to admit that the music sounds a little bit... Pinball Fantasies esque I like. And the sound effect sounds... Sargon! We need the red tower key symbol in the monster box at the top of the screen. All right. And you only have these nine rooms. That's pretty manageable. Yeah. This is best Luke. Why haven't I played this? Sometimes I'm ashamed of wearing the name DOS Gamer if I just skip out on games like this, you know? Because this is. It's a polished thing! And I don't even know which year it's from. If I have to guess, I think this is from 95 or 96. But it might as well have been from 93. How much damage does it take? Alright, I'll try this. You convince me. I should do a live stream on this game sometime. 94! Nice! And if you're checking out this live stream, you're not a member of our Discord yet, come on over and join us. There are four key types, yellow, blue, red and green. Red is to finish the level. <laughs> I just love it that, that the main character is this old geezer with a walking cane. Flip! Oh. That's a different wheel. May I donate my Monty Python PC games on CD to you so you can review them? Reviews. Ooh, it's been a while since I've done reviews, so I'm probably I cannot promise you that I will do a review, but I would love of course to keep them safe and play them. I've had a Monty Python game CD in my hands. I was helping Anna this weekend, the PC King, uh to to um, I jump to sort some stuff out and I had it in my hands he gave me a CD of The Incredible Machine 2 that was such a nice gesture because I told him that that's one of my all time MS-DOS favorites you know yes The Incredible Machine 2 is one of my favorites I'm a nerd deal with it I like this! But now I got it on a CD! I never had it on a CD. I always had bootleg copies. Shame for me to be a pirate, but I was very young. Oh my god, I am standing on the table!
Can you save mid-level? I like this. Dude, this is the second level or are we on a different floor? Where Hey, I put something on the floor while picking that up. Alright, so there's 12 towers, 5 floors each, and I'm on the second floor of the first tower. This is really something I would... Oh. I would love to play through sometime. Maybe on my own pace, maybe during a live stream, I don't know, but this is good stuff. Damn you, Apogee, for making only cool shit. You guys are awful. Mystic Towers HD, when? And can I be the first one to stream it? <laughs> nice, we made the scarab explode. Not hungry. Godverdamme. Uh, a lot of people have difficulties with playing isometric games. I, for one, uh, well, sometimes I do press the wrong buttons, of course, but... I don't have that many difficulties playing an isometric game because I played the one on the ZX Spectrum and those controls were... not very good. Awesome, Sebastian. I'll check it out after the stream. Yeah, but a lot of people have difficulties with directions. Hey, I saw a carpet with a number 4 on it, and now I see a carpet with the number 5 on it. Explain to me how does that work. Hey, I have a levitate thing. Cool. A reveal spell. How do I use that? That's literally a sound effect from Chagan. Probably from the same city. Oh, I can run out of those. Oh, I bet I got 47 left of them. You got money? Give it to me. Don't eat the money, you idiot! <laughs> oh, there's something interesting behind the table. New monster? It's a regenerating and then new monster. Why can I close off all of these doors? Monsters keep respawning. Each tower has a machine that respawns monsters until you blow it up. Alright, that's good to know. A monster spawner. Whoa! Treasure! Treasure! So I'm now on floor 5. I was on floor 4. Thank you guys. I'm really gonna do a live stream on this game sometime soon because I've never played it before and you guys really seem to help me out on this and I'm really enjoying this. Why haven't I played this? I've played hundreds of MS-DOS games. But not this. Hey, we found the red key. That's the one we need. Wait, what's up with that window? Where did that bomb come from? It comes from upstairs. Let's fuck it up. I love it that this game has a minimap. That really helps me... Ease my mind. Uh. 
Is this the monster spawner? No, it's not. A four coin slot which will allow you to buy weapon spells for the higher the tower floor, the stronger the spell. One, two, three, four. Out of order. Too many. Damn it. I should not have done that. Wait, uh, the monsters are being spawned from here. The top right you can see the health of the monster, you can even see how many monsters there are. Drink low. Is this like the Simpsons he's gonna die if he's thirsty? Go get some water. I really dig this game. Hey, that wasn't. A some sort of tesla coil the monster generator is in this room select the bomb and use the action to, s to set it in the generator no more new monsters wait Where's the bomb? There it is. Oh shit! I got the bomb, but... Oh, I got zero bombs. That's the problem. Oh, this is a strong one. Hey, that's a bomb. What was that? He did something and it was really quick. Ah, he killed me. This is something really to check out sometime. This thing is way stronger than I am. Maybe next week. Well, I was thinking about playing Discworld. And I'm not even sure why, because that's another game that I've never played before, but... I was talking about that game with Anna and really quick, and he said it's a good game, and that was enough for me, you know? 
No, not now, next week. <laughs> yeah, but this one says one. Oh, there's a force field around this ladder. Oh, that's really cool. What, is he hungry again? Thirsty? I don't know. Yeah, it's with Eric Idle from the Monty Python, indeed. sure what that means what he does does that mean he's thirsty the monsters from up high I didn't know is there I wish I knew how to use that ladder that just closed the door Tries. Thanks for this awesome suggestion. I'm definitely gonna check out some more on this game. Oh, I'm drunk. That's that's nice. That's always nice. Ay, 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 ay. Do you got unlimited life? Nope. You got six. Nice. I love this game. Good luck tomorrow with the stand-up or try this. Poisoned! Yay! one generator on each level tower nice in the bottom part of the game they kind of they're a little bit off-putting, like it's uh, an extra challenge, but if you don't use those and you know what to do, the game's fine. Boom. Alright, I'll try jumping on them. Hey, 
terug, drukker. I cannot jump on this one. Only from a levitated higher up space. Thank you guys for showing the DOS game at new DOS games. Not respawning anymore now, but I'm eating poison mushrooms for fun, you know. So attacking isn't always winning. I do have another bomb. He poisoned me, damn it. and heal spell. Nice! It's temporary. Hey, we did get the key, right? One of them. Dude, this is fantastic! If you're checking out this live stream right now, hit the like button. Come on. The death counter is accurate. I'm sorry. I don't know where to go now. I don't think I've seen this room yet. Uh, well, I have, but not that side of it. Fun happened. Thanks for being here tonight. I hope you enjoyed it and I hope to see you on the next live stream. 
Next week. Ow, ik sta in de hands. Look at the carpet. Magic carpet. I'm not gonna eat the mushroom anymore. To step up my game. Not hungry. I can barely see myself. I ate the poison mushroom. Probably something to do with pulling it. There's a certain spell on the wall. Follow the carpet. Ah. I'm not sure if this was on the map. This spell, this, this spell, this game is really interesting. Sometimes this happens that, um, that I find a game that really soaks, well, soaks, soaks me up. Bola, zuig me in. Yeah, it, 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 it absorbs me, you know, it's, it's really nice. <laughs> Damn it. Welcome to the family. Frederick. Now we do it. It doesn't happen that often that there's a game that I just didn't play for some reason, not because it's not my game, just I mean, you cannot have played every game, you know, not even as DOS gamers. And same happened with Crystal Caves and uh, the other one, uh, Secret Agent. I just missed out on those and, dude, am I thankful that I played those because that's the reason that Apogee contacted me. They're like, hey, you're DOS gamer, you know shit. Come help us out on developing remasters. And I had to bite my, my lip because I have this community that would... Well, some people would kill, you know, for a new version of the game, and I knew, but they couldn't. 
Oh, nu jeuken ze wel die muggenbult. Oh, joi, 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 joi. Wat een hoerenmug was dat, zeg. Oh, oh, oh. Vier stuks op mijn rug. You can play all. Well, I'm meaning to. Shield on. For a limited time you are invulnerable. Monsters will not harm you. Nor will flames or poison tiles. Fine. Waar was je mee leven? Hey, you know, I'm not gonna pay the wall. Um, it's good that I have this, but now what? Yeah, mosquito. Well, that's the ladder that we already took. I haven't taken this route yet, but... Dude, I love Tyrion. The mini tower on the lower left tells which rooms have monsters remaining. So we need to go to the upper one. Does it matter? Oh, those teleport pads. Yes. Okay. Waar zaten die? And the music for this game. I dig it. Oh, he's thirsty, hungry, I don't know. Where are the teleportation? There they are. How do I get there? Hey. Changes stuff. Nee, niet op staan opeten, Rotjoch. Oh. for more floor pads to use. Oh, that's good to know that you're in a room nearby. I remember that. I don't know where the warp pad is. Jezus, domme trut. I do have to get used to the controls. Yep. I ran out of lives. So I didn't make it. I did. Damn it. Only capital letters, I guess. Alright, this is really something I need to check out during a live stream. Yes, I'd love to. But not tonight. For tonight, I just messed up. And that means for tonight, it's the end of tonight's live stream. We played quite some uh, Cosmos Cosmic Adventure. Maybe next week. 
I have to think about it, but probably. If I do not come up with a better idea for next week, then yes. Next week I'll be playing Mystic Towers on the next live stream on Monday. If you just enjoyed this live stream, then thank you for watching. Be sure to hit the like button, that really helps the channel to grow in the algorithm that's called YouTube. I am really grateful that I can share my hobby playing old games or MS-DOS games or just the games that I like with people like you. It's like having your best friend sitting next to you, although you are some sort of mute but you know how to type. And that's awesome, that's really awesome, that's really worth something to me. You don't know how much that means to me. I've been doing this since I've been 17. I'm 33 right now and I'm really enjoying these old computer games and sharing the love for those with you guys. And the other way around tonight, you guys shown me the love for a game that I didn't know about. Mystic. Well, I did know about it, but I forgot about it. I mean, I, mean, I kind of skipped out on it. And, dude, how... I'm not sure how did I pull this off, but I got green light from Apogee that they didn't mind me showing off the new Cosmo in HD. I mean, that was a worldwide premiere. That's insane. And it was great. I mean, playing it with that frame rate, those colors, that color palette, and that awesome remastered music. I never want to go back again to Cosmo, the original from 1992. I'm not sure about you guys, but I really hope what Jaren said later this night, that they throw it out there this year. Man, I'm really looking forward to it. It's really looking great. It wasn't even finished. Oh, I do think that Apogee likes me as well, and I... Dude, if you tell the five-year-old me that there was going to be a day that I'd be doing stuff for Apogee, like in this form, like they, they would acknowledge me as a human being that would play their games and people enjoy that, then I would never, never believe you that I'd be in direct contact with Apogee. But I'm really happy that it's grown out to be something like this. And I... Can't wait to see what the future is going to bring, but talking about the future, within now and a few minutes, I'm about to go to bed. Well, I'll be probably hanging out on the Discord for a while. If you're not on Discord yet, come on over to DiscordTheDosGamer.com. And for all of you members, subscribers, following, uh, followers, lurkers, people in the chat, people that just follow me around, you guys are awesome and I wish you a very good night and I hope to see you next week maybe with a Mystic Tower stream or maybe Discworld I didn't make up my mind yet but you guys can come on over to Discord and let me know what you would like to see me play next week on the Monday night live stream have a good night waar zit dat knopje en dan moet ik dat andere knopje nog vinden.